Oh, well, well, the heat continues around the Chicago area, and today we're going to bring it up a little bit higher than what we saw yesterday with the spread of temperatures across Chicagoland. What we're looking for here is a mostly cloudy day today, but another mild day. Rain tonight, and then rain ending for the most part by midday Friday. A few showers are left after that, but all in all, the heavier stuff will wrap up midday. Taking a look into the city right now, now we have 33 degrees at O'Hare and um, we have a light south wind at about six miles an hour and that wind is going to help to raise our temperatures very nicely. Temperatures around the area currently the 33 at O'Hare only 21 at Aurora 31 at Ottawa 32 at Rensselaer Indiana temperatures running at O'Hare seven degrees warmer than yesterday at the same time. So uh, seven degrees warmer. We're off to a nice start. You can see the clouds around here, but we have uh, room for some sunshine too, but do expect to see mostly cloudy days as we as we go through the day today, mostly cloudy skies and temperatures that get up to the mid and upper 40s and some people can see 50 degrees around the area. In fact, up at O'Hare, we're looking at 46. It's hard to call uh, with a, a warmer air to the south and colder air to the north here, but this is pretty reasonable the way it's going to lay out 46 at O'Hare 51 and midway 50 at Cake Key tonight 33 with rain entering the area and tomorrow 42 degrees with cold rain through about half the day high temperatures tomorrow 42 at Waukegan to 44 at Kankakee the rain comes in in the early morning or overnight hours overspreads the area could have a touch of snowflakes mixed in out to the the northwest that won't amount to anything really and then it moves on its way. The good news though is we hold on to these temperatures that are seasonable or even above where they ought to be this time of year. 46 today we stay in the 40s little chances of rain on Sunday and Monday and then we close out the seven day period still in the 40s. So that's the good news.